Good morning, everyone. Today is Friday, May the uh, 22nd of the sixth week of Easter. This coming Sunday, of course, the Feast of the Ascension, 40 days after Easter. And uh, it begins now the scripture readings for our every day um, to emphasize more the future, the joy of the gospel, I'm going to call it, because that's what uh, in the recent encyclical, the joy of the gospel of uh, Pope Francis was as well. It's, it's interesting because I say that's kind of a theme for our scripture readings for today. Listen, what does the Lord say to Paul at Corinth in a vision? Do not be afraid. And we have the same thing, basically, in Jesus in the gospel to his disciples. He says, I tell you, you will weep and mourn, but the world will rejoice you will have pain, but your pain will turn into joy, the joy of the gospel. And no one is excluded from that joy, and no part of our lives and us at no time in our lives, because the strength behind everything that we are able to do, that we want to do, comes from the joy of the risen Lord. That's the joy of the gospel, the gospel of the good news, which is why associated with the joy, there is the reason. For I am with you, the Lord says to Paul. Don't be afraid, for I am with you. And Jesus, your pain will turn into joy. I will see you again. The joy has a purpose. The joy has to be shared with others. This joy has to be lived out in our lives. We have to reflect the joy of the gospel in our lives by sharing that joy. And so we need to ask ourselves, perhaps even today, this question, uh, am I afraid, or maybe better, am I a little bit indifferent to my neighbor and hold back from sharing the joy that is mine because of I am a disciple of Jesus Christ? Let's try to reflect on that uh, question today and to see if maybe that would bring us to a little more of the truth of who we are as friends of Jesus. Thanks and have a good day.